My name is Christian and I'm a candy maker and I'm owning a candy manufactory here in Vienna. It was actually um, a funny coincidence how I came to candy because I actually used to be a professional singer and my wife she's a lawyer and we went on vacation to Sweden and we dropped in a small candy manufacturer there and we were so amazed by this craft so that we went home after this vacation and, s and decided, yeah, we're making a candy manufacturer, so it's pretty simple. It's a very old craft, so we're doing a technique which is like about 150 years old. So we had to find, go out and find people old candy makers, like it has a long tradition in Vienna to do candy and this tradition disappeared about like 60 years ago. So our plan was to go out and find old candy makers and my teachers, they are between 75 and 95 years old and they taught me how to do candy. We're doing high quality candy, so there's just natural ingredients, there is natural oils like lemon oil, orange oil and plant colors for coloring and this make what makes it so different. So our products are basically not meant to be eaten in big amounts. You should enjoy every single piece. Most of our candies, we have recipes, they're from 1895, 1899, so most of our candies are really old types of candies, which disappeared like about 60 years ago. When we decide to do a new candy, before we start doing it, we go back, watch the catalogs from these old times, and there we choose like, wow, this candy looks really nice, so we take them the old stuff. Actually, it's a, a very artisan way to make candy. So if you watch every single candy, there is a small picture painted in these candies. Daily, we produce a couple of times and people come in and watch it and see how it's done and with what passion we do it. And that makes it so special overall. We will see where we are in five years. I don't know. We will take it slow and take it easy.